Hey everybody, Steve Tobin reporting at Newsman 1967, and we are here at the Niles Village Hall, municipal building. It is early voting for the 2020 election, and according to the village officials that I spoke with inside, as well as some volunteers that are out here with some signs, uh, it's about three times what the normal uh, voting would be uh, at this particular time, so it's obviously a lot of interest in this particular election. And you can see over here we have all the signs for everything, all the different candidates, everything's coming in over here, and we have more signs over here to catch all this over here. It's a volunteer. One of the volunteers has been outside. So again, um, Niles Village Hall, and we're reporting on the, uh, this is Friday the 23rd, so we have a, about another week and a half or so before we have the general election on November 3rd. So according to the people that I talked to, it's about three times what the normal voting is, so it looks like a lot of interest in this particular election. And, uh, you know, that'll be interesting. And also, uh, what's happening when you're inside there is you'll have an electronic voting screen, and you put in a card, it has a SIM card that's programmed with, with who you are, and you go ahead and you make your choices with the screen, and then you guys should get a printed paper ballot, and you verify that that's exactly who it is you voted for, everything that you voted for um, on the computer screen, and then they run it through, they go ahead and they go ahead and count it. So you basically have the electronic record, and you also have the paper ballot, which is good, so hopefully that will count down on any kind of uh, changing of votes or anything, any kind of voter fraud, so hopefully having the paper ballot will help as well. All right, that's cool. So we'll